Hey there, everybody. I am Caitlin McDonald with Boundless Internet Marketing Solutions and a partner here at the Social Speak Network. So earlier today, I received an email from MailChimp and it just made my day. Um, MailChimp finally has gotten onto the bandwagon of allowing users to create landing pages directly through the MailChimp interface. So why is this so huge? Basically, all the other companies out there um, that a lot of our clients are you know, looking at utilizing for their email marketing already have some sort of way to integrate landing pages into um, their form. So rather than having to embed that form somewhere on their website, they can actually create the entire landing page from one interface. So an example of this would be ConvertKit, for example, where all you have to do is create a form and you have the option to create a landing page that goes along with that form so that you can then just direct people to the landing page rather than having to um, do any coding on your website. So I wanted to jump in and show you how to actually create this landing page on MailChimp. So let me just share my screen here. Okay, here we go. Share screen. Perfect, so this is the, the MailChimp's blog post about um, this exciting new news. And as we scroll down, so the top here shows some examples of what those landing pages could look like. Um, there are flexible templates for building them. You can connect them to your store. So if you have an e-commerce store, this is a great way to have holiday sales and different promotions that relate directly to the products that you're trying to sell. Um, I'm gonna scroll all the way down here to look at the a new way to grow your list. And so, as you can see here, basically these are pretty simple landing pages, but they get the job done, right? They have a background, headline, the logo, a little bit more information, and then you just enter in your email address and click go. Um, they also, MailChimp does have a guide that does give more tips, but I'm gonna jump over to our MailChimp account so that you can see how to actually create a campaign. So I'm already logged in and I am clicking create campaign. And as you can see, the first two options have been there for a long time. And now this third option, create a landing page, is now here. I'm just gonna name the landing page testing page. And then you do have to still select a list. So the first step before you even create the campaign is creating that list. And that's something that ConvertKit, you don't have to do. It creates the list and tags people and adds them to sequences without you having to create that list first. Um, so just keep that in mind as you're going through this so that you don't have to jump back and forth and back and forth. So I just click the website signups and begin. And so this will bring us to a drag and drop editor that looks just like the drag and drop editor of a typical MailChimp email campaign. All you do is you click on the item and replace it. I'm just going to insert kind of a random picture, but that's okay. Um, enticing headline, this. Let's see what we can do with the, um, so you can change the confirmation, thinks you're on the list. This is where I would say something along the lines of, Thanks so much, your download's coming your way or whatever that freebie offer is. Um, sign me up, okay. So again, you can add other elements to the page. So let's say you want some more images of what the product is or the PDF is that you're downloading or you wanna add testimonials or something like that. You can easily add more text boxes, images, image cards and captions and buttons and everything. And um, so this is great. I'm just gonna click into preview it just so we make sure there's no big errors. Of course, I didn't really change anything, right? But here we go. So a nice, clean, simple landing page. Now, I actually want to change the background um, and I'm gonna add an image instead. Insert, let's see, okay. 
Let's just save that. And next up, let's save and continue. Page title and URL. Again, testing page. Save. Goes to the website signups list. The content's all there. And I'm going to click publish. And then this way, we can actually view what that page looks like. So as you can see, I did put in that background image. Um, you'd want to format that image a little bit better. Uh, the image that I chose was a thin image, um, and it didn't go through the header as well. Uh, but again, this is something that you can just play around with and change. But this is just a really easy way and a couple of clicks to be able to create a landing page that you can then direct people to in order to fulfill some sort of offer. And the reason why we like landing pages rather than just embedding forms on your site is because they don't have the clutter of all of the different navigations. So people don't get lost and sidetracked. They know exactly what to do once they get to the page and that's provide their contact information. So this is just a quick tutorial on how to create that landing page for your business. Um, and from here, you know, you can enter people into automation sequences and welcome series um, as a way to further that relationship with them. But it is just so exciting that MailChimp has gotten onto the bandwagon of allowing you to create landing pages directly from their interface. So thank you so much for joining me today. Um, again, my name is Caitlin, and I hope that this has been helpful. Now, if you have created a landing page on MailChimp before, I'd love to hear your notes and comments, so please just leave them down below in the comment area so that we can help each other out as we are starting to use and integrate MailChimp even more into our digital marketing strategies. Thanks again, and I look forward to talking with you again soon.